Hi friends, I'm D Regan. I make a new romaine salad. These romaine um, lettuces, they're really wonderful. They have these uh, crunchy firm leaves. It's a dark leafy green and they're at the same time crunchy and they have a wonderful flavor. They're a little bit strong but still gentle. You can't have it. It's easy to make them in a salad. Otherwise some greens are bitter. Then you have to be a little bit creative how to balance the bitter flavor. Greens in general have a little bit of bitter flavor. Sometimes a little bit more sour. Depends. These are pretty neutral. And the nice that they have this wonderful texture crunchiness so that I can very easily first cut them and when it is too tender I would just tear them apart but the crunchy ones I just stack them and cut them into stripes or whatever now, if there are large ones large um, romaine lettuces there I then cut a little bit different like this but these here it's very easy these uh, mini romaine they call them here and they're also good that's very durable you can you keep in the refrigerator for longer the tender leafy green the regular lettuce the tender ones they are wastes faster so they're very nice these romaines i like them and my new dressing is a cayenne basil sesame orange dressing so it's um basil and cayenne pepper i found that is a very nice combination and uh, orange and sesame seeds, that is a standard. Now I add this cayenne basil combination, very strong, very impressive, expressive, and a little bit of garlic and water. But how to make this dressing? You can watch a video linked under this video. Yeah. But um, when I make a new dressing like this, I create some new salads with combinations I already know. For the romaine, for example, I use here as a, a corn and bell pepper classic combo wonderful in salads yeah you can have it fresh from the corn or frozen um, from the cob it doesn't matter whatever you have the fresh ones maybe are a little bit better but the frozen ones are either way and I have a bell pepper here a red bell pepper and half an onion that's it yeah that's a very nice combination I chop the onion up that's very simple that's all and there's all these ingredients are all nice together uh, they are made for each other. They're very nice in salads. Yeah, you can have so many variations of lettuces. Yeah, you have uh, so many things, and um, the the leaf is important that it is it is crunchy or is it firm or is it very tender, and then um, the flavor is it very bitter? Is it gentle, neutral? And then you can combine the other ingredients. And this is a nice combination, I would say. And now I try my new dressing on this salad. I show you the dressing what it looks like. From the from the basil, it's a little bit green. Yeah. Put the rest on top. That's all I need. Don't need that much. And it's no salt in this dressing. And that's interesting. Usually, um, salt is a flavor enhancer. Uh, put it in many dressings. Um, a little bit of salt goes a long way. Um, if you have a normal diet, that means whole food, plant-based, that is normal for me. And you make your fresh food, then you can use a, a small amount of salt, that's okay. We need six gram every day to survive, so this is a very small amount. And if you have um, um, fast food and these things, usually there's a lot of salt in the things you can buy with the ready-made food. Oftentimes have a lot of salt and sugar. And then you have a different story, then I would be careful with using salt. But uh, with a whole food plant-based diet is your preferred diet. A little salt is great. But this has no salt, this dressing. And that is possible because the flavor is enhanced already by this combination. On the one side is um, um, basil and cayenne, very expressive. And then the sesame orange, also very rich orange juice, uh, like... Um, um, expands the other flavors. Orange juice in many recipes a very great ingredient, especially in raw food. Orange juice, I have always a lot of oranges at home to make an orange juice for smoothies, uh, juices, um, soups, dressings. It's, it's very nice. So and here I have it in the dressing, the orange juice. It's the main part of the dressing. I mean you can watch the video. There you can see it. 
it's not difficult. And I just um, toss a little bit and so I can see that I have enough dressing. So sometimes you need a little bit more, sometimes a little bit less. Especially this dressing, as it has no salt, you would like to have um, a more from the flavor of this dressing. Yeah. Maybe more dressing, because it has no salt. You want to have that flavor of the orange juice and the other... That's nice. So I, let's see if it works. Um, I think it looks good, but I have to make sure. Mm. 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 Awesome. Oh yeah, I like it. Here, my new salad. Ta-da! <laughs> yeah. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy all very life. Mm. Love it. Greens every day. Must. <laughs> Thanks for watching again. If you like my video, like, subscribe, and you're being on YouTube. Have another recipe every single day and find me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and Twitter.